So, welcome back. And today I've got Tanuki Sama, my son, Hi. with me. And uh, we're going to be building a co op build. But we're going to do it a little bit different. And uh, we're going to do it using Smedit. So, we're going to start mm -hmm. off by going to 3D. Smedit just sounds like weird. 3D Warehouse. Yeah, SM Edit. Is that better? <laughs> and then uh, we're going to click on the Google SketchUp 3D Warehouse. Now, what can you think? Anything. Um, Anything at all. It doesn't matter. Speeder. A speeder. I'll type speeder. I can, I can type as well. <laughs> speeder. Right, okay. Which one? We've got um, a Star Wars speeder. Imperial. We've got the Star Wars land speeder. One. The land speeder. Yeah. Alright, let's have a look at this. So, what we're going to do is we're just going to have a little look see here. I'd say that looks pretty sweet. Okay, I don't know so exactly what it looks like on actual Star Wars film though. We'll have to recolour it, won't we? The model's right though. But I don't care, it looks pretty nice. So now we're going to open SketchUp. And there's SketchUp. So then we're going to... It gonna... sounds like ketchup. <laughs> it does just, sound like it ketchup. It is ketchup, just with an S on the beginning. I sm smed it. <laughs> a SketchUp. <laughs> it is, yeah, it is actually ketchup <laughs> with an S at the beginning. You're right. So then, what we're going to do is we're going to download the uh, Land Speeder to our downloads folder. Oh no, wait. Sorry, we're exporting the OBJ now. Let me just do sort of file and then uh, export 3D model. And then we're going to go to. I mean, if you followed my previous tutorials, we go to C Drive OBJ and then just copy it in there. I'm going to change the name a little bit to just land speeder and uh, export because we're going to lose all of the texture information. So, okay, alright, so now we can close this and uh, use Binbox to convert the model. So what we're going to need to do is we've done, this, we've done the SketchUp now so we can close this and uh, we can then go to the bin box page on minecraft.gamepedia.com where you can find all of the uh, dimensions and we're going to use binbox hyphen d um, uh, and uh, also hyphen ri uh, and yeah so what we're going to do is open the obj folder on our c drive and i've made a shortcut to cmd if i check out the properties here i've changed the path start in Right. Who's that? I don't even have a guy called Mark McLeod on my PC. Okay. Do, 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 do. So what I'm going to do is maybe I downloaded the shortcut from someone. Anyway, I'm going to copy here. It, copy. It always looks like McDonald's. And then Control A, Control V. So it's starting C O B J. Okay, and then open it. Now we've got our command line, and we can type binbox hyphen D. How big do you want it? Um, 200 long or 100 long? 100 long is probably cool. Yeah. 100. Whoops. Binbox 100 hyphen RI and then the name of the model. So we just open this, open the folder and look for it. I think it was just called Land Speeder. Yeah, it's just so, Land Speeder. Uh, where's the OBJ file? Just to make sure. There it is, land speeder. So I'm gonna, gonna rename control A, control C, and paste. So I know I've got it exactly right. Enter. And off it goes. Quick, quick, get that. Oh, I can't move it into the capture, so you can't see the awesome scanning. Oh, nah, it's too late. I think it's finished. Oh, wait, no. There's still a few bits left. It pretty much done everything though. And boom, it's done. So now all we have to do is open up uh, SM Edit. Okay, so now we've got our model made. I'm gonna exit this command line. And then we're gonna go over to the SM Edit page. And we're just gonna make sure that we're using <coughs> this command line here, which will give us a gigabyte of memory for the tool. So you're gonna do the same thing as before. Um, open up your StarMade folder. 
and then inside your StarMade folder, which you'll find Smedit, and I'll make a screenshot for you. You'll find SMEdit in here somewhere. I know this is right, JSM. Okay. Um, I've also made an XML file for schematics, just on a side note. And you just you chuck that in there, and if you want to import schematics, it will get the blocks right when it converts them. It won't just be all grey hull, which is cool. Um, but yeah, moving on, what we're going to do is we're going to open up SMEdit on the command line. So you use the, make another shortcut. Which takes you into where you know the shortcut is right here by mine, and then I'm just going to type cd space star made. Make sure you get the capital letters right, and then uh, dir, and this is where we're going to be. So now all I need to do is copy this command from the SMEdit wiki and uh, paste that in. That loads Smedit, and this was the last thing I was working on. <laughs> Mushroom Street. Yeah. But we're gonna go file, import, uh, binbox, and then we're gonna go find it. So here, here we go, obj, landspeeder.binbox, open. Okay. Right then, it looks okay. What colors do you want it? Um, Brown? The actual Star Wars color. Yeah, I think it was brown in Star Wars. No, it was red. Was it red? Yeah, it was red. Okay, so we're going to go red, all. And okay. then the engines were black on the back. Black on the back, right. So we're going to put Just the paint the radius up and hit black. And then right click the engines. Not, not all of it, just the bit that you did first. Oh, really? Yeah. I'll see if I can undo what I did. Oh, no. Okay, we'll start again. Finbox. Run speeder. Okay, uh, da, da, da. red, all, black. Back. Just the back. Mhm. Mm on, on all three of them. Oh right. Okay. And on, on the other side. Well, I think I might have to detail it in the game, so I'll do my best. Hang on. I reckon if I tag them from the end. Oh wait, that's the wrong end. Uh. No, Dad. Oh no! Okay, right, so we'll just go red and undo it. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh look, see, I missed a bit. Okay, right, so black. Uh, flip it over, right. Yeah. Okay, what and else? And um, then around the edge, like... What, like a line? Yeah, like a line link that links the engine is yellow. Is yellow? Mm-hmm. What? It is a yellow strip. It goes down the side? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like that. Just down the side? So, no, on the front and, and down the, the other side as well. Like that. Cool, and then that's a windscreen up there at the front, isn't it? Mm hmm, so that would be glass. So what we'll do is we'll use white. Hang on. Is that all glass? Hang on. Go down to what? Take it down to one. Yeah, it's still a bit more, isn't there? Mhm. Mm it's the detail. And what's this? It's kind of hard to make it out. All right. And it isn't on the other 
It's all right. It's not going to be perfect. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Right. So that entire bit there. Yeah. White. So now what we'll do is we'll use. Hang that on. bit there though. Yeah. Wait. We'll go <coughs> mods. Replace. And then we're going to use a white hull. And we're going to change it to water. Bang. And now we've got. Whoops. And now we've got a. Uh, windscreen. We've got a windscreen. Right. Uh, we can put plex doors. No, it doesn't have doors. Just there so people can get in. Mm. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. There is an inside to it. <laughs> yeah, there is. It's supposed to be hollow, but it looks like it had an interior and it's kept some of it. So I did tell it to hollow it out, and it didn't seem to have. Um, so yeah, okay. So we we'll use white again. bit of something there. I think that's supposed to be like a strap that goes with like a roll bar or something. I'm not sure. Um, but uh, we can fix like little bits that are wrong, you know, when we actually mm. load it up. Yeah. So right, mods, replace blocks, replace white hull with P. I'm just pressing the key by the way. Flex door. And then we got some flex doors, right. And I mean, you could just continue this process, you know. I could be like replacing with thrusters, replacing with guns, but we're not going to do that. We're going to go in the game and do that. Um, plus speeders don't have guns. No. Exactly. <clears throat> so, save as blueprint. I'm going to call it land speeder. Billy. Okay. Just and. Yes. Yeah, so. uh, and we can make some screen detail. I'm going to exit. And then and we can clean make some up. extreme That's detail it. in the We can view, yeah. Thing. And now we're going to load it up. Yay. So uh, let's so switch over to computer. StarMade. So welcome back. Here we are in StarMade. And Billy's in the stealth ship up here. And uh, we're just checking out the land speeder that we just created. So here it is. It's in its current up. state. We've obviously got to do a little bit of work to it to change it up. but. It's red, it's got the yellow stripe, <laughs> uh, the engines have got black bits on the end, looks like I messed up a bit there with some yellow, and then uh, we've got a windscreen, you can see inside there, I've got and a door. I've got nothing in my inventory, but grey hole, SDC, power, well, we won't do the detail on it, we won't do the detail on it right now, but what we will do is we'll... We'll make it work, okay? Well, okay, no, so absolutely nothing. so both of us are in build mode. I've got to give Billy some some blocks, yeah. and then we can get on and do this. Build ready. Um, this is uh, it works. It flies. It has shields. It has power. It has thrusters. Um, it took us about what half an hour to make. Yeah. And um, like I say, let's take a quick look inside. So the front end is shields. Um, are there any weapons? No weapons yet, but plenty of room for weapons. We've got plenty of room here to clean this up. On the back, maybe. We've got a door to get in. So when can you put the arm You've on got the to back? go around the back. You go around the back. We've got more power here. It's still under construction. <laughs> and then you'll see there's a core which you can get into somewhere. Can't hear. I'm a third person mode. Um, I was, yeah, I've got a little base down there. Look at that. Doesn't that look cool? I'm so big compared to the planet. Here we go, look. If there was anybody actually on the planet, they'd be frightened to death. Yeah, do you want to try landing it, see what happens? Press C to make it flat. <laughs> watching it go flat is weird. Right, I'm going to go into the reverse. Okay, and downwards. Which one's down? Uh, Q. Mm. Slowly! Oh! Uh, it's alright, that was a good landing. Um. 
I'm getting out. Look. Ooh. Are we still moving? No. Are we still moving? It's a pretty cool spaceship. <laughs> I thought we were going to be able to get out now. Yeah, you are. Sure. What, gravity? Oh, you yeah. can't get out the door. <laughs> just make a hatch in the floor. Make a hatch. There you go. No, you just dropped out the bottom. I'm coming. Yeah, it is back. being supported by a cactus. A cactus and a big bit at the back. Well, that's it, and that's all that's important. Now, get rid of the cactus, and see if it falls down. Okay. Okay, I'm doing this for science. <laughs> I'm going, you've got to watch and see what happens. I'm getting away, but I don't get crushed. Right, one. Oh! Run! Run! Isn't it? No. Oh, I thought it was going to be like Prometheus. <laughs> Hang on. Um, I'm not going to be able to get back in as well. Um, I'm going to make another hole. Don't make too many. I've got to save the blueprint. Right, I'm, I'm taking a core unit to the cop to the cockpit. Hang on. No. Right. I need to get to the core. So we've got to run in here, and then we run under here. Oh gosh. Oh. Oh yes, I made it. I made it. Right. Ship core. Right. Save it. Right. Thanks everyone for watching. Um, it's been fun. Say goodbye, bit. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Cool. Bye bye. And I'll see you next see time. See you later.